Hello YouTube, this is the Halo Guy 54 and today I have a little tutorial on how to control your computer with your iPod Touch, your iPhone, or your iPad. Okay, so the first thing you will have to do is have an account at logmein.com. Okay, so you know, I'll show you how to do that real quick see if I can get this to log me out. Alright, what you want to do is, here I'll take, I'll show you with the home page. Here's the home page, okay. The first thing you want to do is press, press create an account, okay. Second thing you want to do is it'll take you to this screen right here. Make sure you click the first little, you know, bullet circle thing, okay. Uh, you want to click this one because this is, you know, what you're going to be using LogMeIn for. The second one is for, like, business people where they, like, can create, you know, like a confin conference room type thing where, you know, they can all, they can talk to all their other people in their business or whatever. You know, it's it's hard to explain, and I really cannot tell you how to set that up it just it's so confusing and I'm not even joking but okay and then you know you press continue it'll take you to this screen it wants your email and a password like you know you're signing into Facebook or MySpace or you're creating one of those you know uh, after you fill this out make sure you click no on this okay now after that it'll take it'll create your account it'll send a verification email to your to the address that you typed in okay make sure you go and verify that before you do this next step okay after you verify what you want to do is click add computer it won't look like it won't look exactly like this screen because these are the computers that I have hooked up already. Okay, but you want to click Add Computer. Okay, and then it will take you to this screen that says Download and Install Log Me In. Okay, I already have that installed. It's right here, but I'll just show you what you have to do. Let's open that. Okay, you want to click Install Log Me In. Okay, it'll pop up with this little box right here. Just go ahead and click next. Okay, and there will be two boxes instead of three because I already have it on my computer. Okay, there will be um, the standard version, okay, which is like recommended. It's for beginners. Okay, and then there's another one. It's the custom version, okay. You don't want to download the custom unless you are very familiar with this already. Okay then you know you click next you know I agree and it'll come to this and I'm just gonna click no and then you know it'll install and download what it needs which the log me in okay uh, program and it'll take you to this screen you just press finish okay and after that it will open up this box right here now you don't have to worry about these next steps or whatever okay just uh, exit out of that now the second thing you'll need to do is install the logman app on your iPod okay it's a thirty dollar app and if you don't want to pay for it and you have your device jailbroken don't worry it's in install this okay so you know sorry I don't have you know a camera to record my iPod so I'm j I just took some pictures and I'm gonna show you what it'll look like okay uh, so you open up install this okay and you just type in log me in all one word okay and here's the icon alright so after you download and install it it'll be on your one of your pages okay and then you'll open up log me in okay and then this screen will pop up. Uh, no, it's not an all black screen. It's just loading. Okay. 
it'll pop up like this okay what you want to do is type in your email that you registered with and the password that you made with your email okay and then you know you can click that or you don't have to but if you don't then you have to just type in your email and password every time again okay after that the this is the next screen that'll pop up okay it's uh you know it's got your registered computers on there okay and for every computer that you have you'll have to reinstall the program okay but then after that you can choose which computer you want okay i have an hp and a toshiba after that it'll come up with this little screen okay because it's wi-fi you know it's wireless internet it will take a minute to load okay it'll have to connect and then it'll load and then after it's done loading it will come up with this screen right here and this you know after when you see this screen you're already logged into your computer okay and this just tells you because you don't have a mouse you know hooked up to your iPod okay this will tell you how to do it you know one finger is you know to pan and move the mouse okay but when you're on log me in it'll seem kind of weird because when you know you're moving your mouse it looks like you know it, it's like you're not moving your mouse at all you're actually moving the screen like the mouse is in the center of your screen and you're moving the screen you know to click a program or whatever as you can see right here this will show that you're on your iPod in log me in okay it'll just say this computer is being remotely controlled by you know whatever your user and iPod stuff is okay and then you can see it's kind it might be a little slow but that's just because of the high res of the screen on your iPod and stuff you know it's a lot of memory for your RAM to be running okay and then you know you can you can open up your programs okay like now I have this open and it's all on your iPod okay like it'll look pretty small okay on your iPod but that's you know that's because I'm on a 17 inch screen and the iPod's like three inches okay but to zoom in and out is just like on the internet you know you put two fingers and you pull towards the screen to zoom in and you push you know to zoom out alright well uh... that's it for this video rate comment subscribe thank you youtube for watching my tutorial Okay.